What do we got? Hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode here on Past Teach of Skin. Today we are playing Speedrunners on the PS4. Actually, it would have been that hand to gesture up to it. So have any of you guys ever played have you ever played speedrunners? I no, I have not. No. Well, James McAnesby, we are here to play some speedrunners. It's a multiplayer game. It, does, it can be played single player, but it's so much more fun multiplayer. Brilliant. Essentially what speedrunners is, is imagine Mario Kart by way of N plus, and the whole thing is to be the last person on the screen, like micro machines. Okay, brilliant, yes, okay. So as like, the three bases to kind of pick from there, so Mario Kart by way of N plus as a runner game, like runner around level, and you have to be on the last one on the screen, like as you used to score points in micro machines. So that that's the three things that I actually describe this game as to anybody else. And usually people are going like, I like at least two of those. I was about to say I like at least two of those. <laughs> at least two of those, that's the description for it. I swear that guy's from Crash Bandicoot. <laughs> well, the guy from Crash Bandicoot was only the mask. That guy's actually the rest of his body as well, on top of it. What do we got? So yeah, uh, pretty much in this, uh, the dead the, again, this is a demo experience, so we're going to get to play a couple of levels. Um, I think what we should do is play three matches and total out which one of us do the best out of the three matches. Yeah. So okay. essentially it's three points to win, uh, first to three each time. But we are going to be competing against a bunch of computer opponents as well, so they could kick our asses. Ah, okay, brilliant. I was about yeah, to say, because you'll just... You've already played it, have you? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah but they, and the computers are absolute assholes, so I might actually get my ass beat by the computer specifically. Uh, I'll just uh, cozy up the computers. Computers are great overlords. <laughs> I, re I respect our new technological <laughs> overlords. Yeah, exactly. I was watching Age of Ultron earlier on and going like, yep, yep, I'd be okay with that. Yeah. Guys, also because he sounds cool as fuck. <laughs> uh, was... oh, it's like fucking creepy at all, hell version of the Pokemon thing. Oh, there you go. So you do, have you ever seen that movie? I have not. Huh? Oh, for God's sake. So uh, Ultron... Avenger oh, hang yeah, on. Avengers Age of Ultron, the giant robot in it. Yes, yeah, sorry, yes. Uh, it's uh, James Spader. The yeah, James Spader doing the yeah, voice. Yes. Yeah. That was actually a really good impression because uh, I was thinking, is this James Spader? Yeah, yeah, that's, that's, that's what it is. The, the Age of Ultron didn't actually click with me. But uh, yes, yeah. it's, 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 you're all just puppets. Tangle. String. Oh, man. And, like, even doing the voice actually makes me feel because he, he was so fucking menacing in it. And it's like a petulant child while well, being menacing as well because this whole thing about him hating Stark. Because he's essentially his father. Brilliant. I just, I just rewatched the movie, so I don't think I don't, I don't think anybody cares what my opinion of the Avengers movie is. But god damn, it's really entertaining. Go over and watch Age of Ultron again. I recommend it. So let's talk about speedrunners. Let's run. <laughs> Which was the point of being here in the first place. Speedrunners, yeah. <laughs> Alright, so essentially we're gonna play a local party game. Uh biz controls are X is jump. Okay. Triangle is the slide. Yeah. Circle is the drop weapon. Okay, so like a and, sort of thing. Yeah, All and right. I th and square is to shoot a grappling hook. The grappling hook will only attach to roofs that are white. Okay. So you can use that to swing ahead of your opponents or jump over gaps and stuff or swing yourself up to a higher level as you're running around the level. It'll take a wee while to get used to, but essentially all you have to do is remember, try to stay on the screen. Right, okay. Don't let yourself lag too far behind. And uh, what's the screen look like? Uh, Smash Brothers? It, it looks more like N+. Plus. So it's all platforms, you run and jump down, run and run and run. And it's actually, it'll be a track that you're essentially running. So you'll do laps of it over and over again until people die. Right, okay. Let's, yep. let's have a look then and see. <sighs> yeah, so different weapons you pick up do different things. Uh, so this is what our characters are. Press X to join in. Right, so I'm the black one. You're the pink one. So I'm lagging behind here. Well, I've been frozen as the block, so I'm gonna, <laughs> you're going to catch up with me very quickly. <laughs> and I'm like picking you press up power circle. Yeah, press circle to use the power. Yeah, you turned the guy in the ice. Nice. Oh, oh god, I got that back. Nicely done. Some wall jumping action here. Is it just us two, right? No, it's three. The computer opponent's there as well. The blue guy. I got a super jump there. I don't know how I did it. You pressed uh, X twice to double jump. And square to grapple. So yeah, oh, you oh, dirty oh, bastard team! <laughs> I will catch up with you. <laughs> oh, I did not know you could actually sprint with R2. Ah, no. Ah, oh, fuck's sake. So essentially... So literally, as soon as you go off the screen, you're done. Uh, you're done. And then you notice the screen gets smaller as the match goes longer because they want to kind of like speed it up a wee bit. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, shit. No. Oh, uh, bastard. Yeah, he's grabbing a hook on you. Oh, God damn it. 
<laughs> Force them actually to glow red. It's got the screen. Uh, it's gonna catch up. Ah, <laughs> I'm the winner. Oh, winner, winner, chicken dinner. Okay, so yeah, so we'll definitely get into this game very quickly. Oh yeah, <laughs> it's one of those games where you get a, you find the character that you like playing as well. Whenever you're playing the full game, you're gonna like, you demand what people that are like I'm playing as the fucking dude with the fish head or the unicorn horn. <laughs> oh, God damn it! Oops. Thing is, you need to know the maps a little bit. Oh well, I mean, the, over a while you'll start to learn the maps, but they're not that difficult to memorize. Like after after a lap, you know the map. The first lap will always be a pain in the hole. Oh! Come on, come on. Come on, this is my chance. Come in. Come in, man! See, that's not fair. See, I'm mad as he is, and he's, and he's holding me back now. Yeah, well, it's gonna make it more hard. It's harder for you to actually figure out what's going on. Ha 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 ha! Uh oh, ah, there you fuck. go. I thought that was a white uh, thing there. Oh, the walls? No, the, the walls are actually for uh, wall jumping. Boom! Was that actually me won a match? So, first three, is three. Three-nil, yeah. Yeah. Oh, is that just one match? Is that's, that's just one match, so okay, we got, we, we've got a few more to go. Alright, cool. So cool. we've got three of these matches, three different doubles each time. So, essentially, if you win this one, that'll be at 1-1. One, one. So, the mechanics of the game, being as simple as they are, and being a runner game... <laughs> You can pick this up so easily, throw it in front of your friends, and just be ra hammered away level after level in this so quickly. And one of the things I discovered whenever I was playing it multiplayer last time is that you can literally just drop in and drop out of play. If you have four pads plugged in, you can just like pick up a pad, press X, and you're playing as one of the a AI characters. In the same way, if you actually like drop the pad and log yourself out, or like between rounds, it'll not assume that you want to play until you press a button. So it'll just turn it back into AI. So you could just have this running on a loop with your friends coming in and out and actually playing around while you're having like lunch or whatever else. This is designed as like a college dorm kind of like game where people just walk in, walk just out throughout the day. Out, yeah. yeah. And, and sometimes those kind of games are the best experiences you'll ever have. And like there's a couple of games I played whenever I was at college was uh, Marvel Heroes or Marvel Ultimate Alliance because it was a drop in, drop out arcade experience where you'd always had the four characters on screen, but it only, um, it only mattered if any of the controllers were logged in, the rest of the time would be played by AI or the one player would actually switch between characters as they were needed. And um, I think I probably played through that game at least a dozen times with my housemates. So one some person would come in from work and would literally just pick up a controller, play for 15 minutes, then go and like shower, change, start cooking dinner. or like uh, People would just pass in and out of the room throughout the day and you'd have pretty much the game completed by the, entire, like, by the end of a session. And like the same feeling you would have like going into an arcade where people would like drop in, drop out by after like yeah. putting in a credit or two. Such a great experience, and it's something that we lack in a lot more games now. Oh no, you caught up with me! Ah, oh, fuck. Right, fuck this. Oh no! Oh, you got it! You got it! Uh, fuck you! Oh! You know, get rid of me. No! Oh, come on. Backfired. No! Oh, oh damn finally. you. Finally. <laughs> oh, unicorn? Yep, that's what you are. Unicorn man. You know, unicorn is the uh, national emblem of Scotland. I did not know that. That's why the national know. animal of Scotland is or something? National emblem, yeah. Oh, it's, uh, yeah. Do you know they have the lion and the unicorn? Yes. And that's why. Boom! All right, I just like Shit. wheeled the twos out of the way there. That was like, I just that? took the, I had the red, uh, the lava ball and it bounced, oh, bounced off two of these. You son of a bitch! <laughs> I'll just take half the team out. Yep. Yeah. <sighs> oh, I just missed me. Take the sprint, take the sprint, take the sprint. Oh no! Oh yes. You fuck. <laughs> Take night by the wall. Bye. Oh, you fuck. <laughs> Why did you uh, go back? Oh, fuck. Thought you could get a boost from it? No, I thought, I thought that was the. I thought it was another S-Man. 
I'm trying to... Oh, no, it's not the S-Bend. Oh, shit. I'm trying to remember the maps and stuff, you see. <laughs> see, that's the problem, man. I've already had, like, like, I've played this a couple of times, but it's like, like I said, once you get a first lap around, you should have the map memorized. Oh, nice. That was Batman the shit out of that. I actually connected to the upper roof and swung through the lower roof. Fuck off. Doing that on a goddamn ramp. That's an asshole move. So wait, wait, probably done. Oh! <laughs> shit. I nearly lost it there. <laughs> shit. Ah! Yes! Uh, oh, that was a perfect swing. <laughs> yes. All right. So it does. Do you want to go for one more just for like that? Not not for glory run, but more the fact that like a redemption run. Yeah. All right. Let's, cool. Let's do it. Let's see if we can do it. Because you did, you got you were really getting getting the levels right there. Oh, it's such a simple simplistic games that actually really deliver on a great mechanic. Yeah. No, I t totally. Um, like this is all just based on. Uh, like I, I could have hours of fun on this one. Yeah, and it, like, it's one of those things that you could actually have friends who've never really played games otherwise would jump into it so quickly. Yeah, like the, the learning curve is not that steep. Uh, Reaction times though are kind of required, so it's not a drinker's game. <laughs> well, totally. Yeah. As most games generally aren't made for drinkers, <laughs> this is the fact a lot of drinkers will play them. Hey, oh, I missed you with the golden thing. Am I going in the right direction? Yeah, yeah, you are. <laughs> you didn't see the spikes coming though. Oh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> Whoops. Too much. Uh, Too much pepper on that one. Are you serious? Oh, I caught uh, you behind the wall and it pulled me into the wall and got me stuck. Alright. Alright. Need to be selective with that. Watch out. This is going to be quick. Yeah, I, was gonna, I was giving you a slight chance here because you actually decided to lose one of your hands. So I still need to find out what the boosts are and stuff. And, uh... Oh yeah, the thing that you... Whenever you go through those uh, boosters, it's R2 to actually boost your character to make them run a little bit faster for a little while. But I'm just holding down R2. It's so... <laughs> <laughs> you just be using it every single time you get it? Yeah, well, I was just <laughs> holding it. <laughs> That's not exactly fair. Oh no, I can't get the height for that. Ah, oh, <laughs> come on. Everybody got nailed by that. Ah, oh, nobody hit the switch. Woohoo! Oh no, I missed the swing. There's a screen. Ah, oh, come on. Yeah, it's just uh, that boost throws you so far ahead. Like, if it's oh, it's going to be a decider on so many of the laps. Oh, nope. Everybody missed that one. <laughs> oh! Swing, swing. Drop down. Balls. Fuck myself over. Uh, as, soon as, you, as soon as you get to memorize the... Uh... The room layout, it's kind of one of those things yeah. where you just... You're, you're, you're not annoying yourself for not catching it just in time rather than actually messing it completely. <laughs> Bye, chicken. Oh, I'm dying, I'm dying. Uh, uh, I'm dying. Come so on, die, chicken. God damn it. Looks like this chicken's taking his time. Oh, no. He's going to catch up. Did you ever play... Um... You fuck! Oh, you bastard! Oh, he's heavy. Yeah, he's got that one. Like, like, I, like, unless I run across the bottom of the map until he comes back again. <laughs> like, that was it. He's kept me, in, he's kept me alive. <laughs> good, good man, Falcon. Yeah, you goddamn chicken. He's not a man, he's a chicken, boo. <sighs> I heard it completely. Ooh. Did you ever play a game oh. called um, Guacamole? Oh, Guacamole is awesome. Yeah, so this reminds me of Guacamole. <laughs> Yeah, you actually, style wise, it kind of reminds me of it. Um, especially the El Polo Loco <laughs> in the middle yes, of it. Yes, yeah. <laughs> Just to be racist to stay on the screen and stuff. Oh, yeah. I, 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 Guacamelee was a really fun game uh, on Vita, but I didn't enjoy it on console. 
Well, uh, it's, it's, I've it's, never it's, seen it on Vita. And it's I, essentially I the same game, it. but it was just having the portability of it. It was actually was really, really fun. It was one of those games I played without traveling so much, but I never really got into playing whenever it came out with a, a console version of it. Well, see, me and, me and my housemate were playing a co-op, and it was it made it a lot more fun, I think. Uh, uh, oh, like, actually, yeah, no, it would be a lot more uh, fun. Oh, did it not make it a bit easy? Well, it wasn't. It wasn't exactly, you know, overly challenging. It wasn't. No, was, no. I mean, but I mean, since yeah, it was what it was one of the games where like you just burned through it so much more. Yeah, it was, that was it, and then we just went around collecting stuff and everything. And yeah. uh, but it was it was the speed runs and everything, and yeah, that, that's like highly recommend. I'd well prepare this. Like. Yeah, speed run is an amazing game. Uh, if yeah, uh, it's one of those games that I actually I could I would love to get a party session going on here with some of the guys in for like a, a full four player Three, crack of it. Four like this is a, this is a shout and screaming match waiting to happen. Like it yeah. literally is like just a, it's a murder your friends simulator essentially because you'll have so much fun with it. Speedrunners, massive thumbs up. I highly recommend Definitely, it. Yeah. Uh, like I said before, the three things that it, it makes this combination is the. Um, what was the three? <laughs> micro machines. Yeah, no, the micro machines was the last one to go with because it's actually the two to two, and then micro machines is the kind of Mario Kart. Yeah, so it's Mario Kart chase N+. game by way of N plus for the level design and the winning point by actually doing micro machines last man on screen, which pissed so many people off back in the nineties, and it was such a good game mechanic. Yeah, it was so much fun. Highly recommended. Check out Speedrunners on PlayStation Four and on PC. It's been out for ages. Uh, if you enjoyed us playing the game and actually enjoyed um, the, watching the experience of us playing through it and how much we hated each other for the few seconds that you were winning. Uh, then thanks very much for watching and I hope you actually come back and watch more here again Make sure to hit the subscribe button at the top because you've enjoyed it And if you don't want to do the subscribe button thing, you don't like doing that All you have to do is remember pastiche of skin. The name is right there. Just search for it I'm not trying to hide. I'm right around there and it. all you have to do is type in the name and if you're watching this on YouTube Right, so the buttons up there now of course and over here will be three playlists Well, playlists and two other videos playlists showing cold opens here over in the far side will actually be uh, the most recent video on the channel. And right over the top of James's head will be a video recommended for you based on your user analytics and the things that you do on YouTube. If you want to watch more stuff on this channel and you don't know what to pick, pick that one. It'll always be something that you want to see. So thank you very much for watching and we'll see all you dudes Bye. in the next video. Bye. Sorry, Rich.